Matthew 6 verse 33. Seek ye first the kingdom of God and His righteousness, and all these things shall be added to you. What things is being spoken of here? Many times people think it's like just everything yes. that I, my heart desires will be given to me if I just put God first. Then all these things, the basic necessities of life, the things that we mm. need for survival, mm. Those are the things that God will provide for us. And He has promised His children that. Eh? Yes. Mm -hmm. He says, your bread and, and your, your water will be sure. I think it's David that says, in one of the Psalms, he says, I've been young and I've been old, but I've not seen a child of God forsaken mm -hmm. or, or go hungry or anything like that. So, yes, it is the basic necessities that will be added unto us if we put God first. And it's beautiful to think that you know, if we put God first, will be happy and satisfied with just the basics. Okay. But if we have much more than just the basics, but we don't have God in our life, mm. then there's no mm. true joy and happiness. How mm. can one put God first, practically? It's starting, um, you know, with a devotional life early in the morning. It's, mm. you know, uh, as families putting God first, as so there's family worship in the mm. morning. You know, too many families nowadays, you know, we're busy with, with the eating, the drinking, you know, the putting on of, uh, of the clothes, the uniform, mm. etc. And then rushing off to work, to school. And we haven't had time as a family mm. to connect and seek God first. Mm. And, and children don't learn priorities by what we say, okay. but by what we do. Yeah. So we True. can say God's a priority, but if there's no worship, there's no... Um, um, the devotional life, they can see that. Mm. In, in Daniel chapter 6 verse 10, the Bible tells us that a, a habit that Daniel had was daily prayer. Mm. And in Acts chapter 17 verse 1 and 2, a habit that Paul had was he went to the synagogue. Mm. And mm. so in our society today, there's also lots of people that, that are forsaking these habits. Like, mm. like was just mentioned, you know, we don't Pray in the morning. Don't start your day with God. Mm. Another habit that's also being forsaken is you know, regularly attending the synagogue. Luke chapter mm. 4 verse 16 also tells us that Jesus had discussed him mm. to go to the synagogue on the Sabbath day. Mm. We can see God first and put God first in our time. Mm -hmm. That's every morning. Um, and then of course, ending the day with Him as well. Exactly. You know? um, we can put Him first also in, in, in the relationships we have. Oh!